A day in the life of Mark Zuckerberg. Mark Zuckerberg has a lot on his plate. The 36-year-old runs Facebook, the social media giant, with a market cap of $855 billion. It is therefore not surprising that the tech CEO has quite a lot to do throughout the day. That being said, Zuckerberg still makes the time to exercise, travel extensively, and spend time with his family. Let's take a look at a day in the life of Mark Zuckerberg. Depending on how you look at it, Facebook co-founder and CEO Mark Zuckerberg either has a zero work-life balance or he He's actually pretty good at it. After waking up at 8 a.m., the Facebook founder immediately checks Facebook, Facebook Messenger, and WhatsApp on his phone. He told Jerry Seinfeld in a Facebook Live Q&A. Out of the bed, you go to the bathroom. Oh, I don't, uh, no, the first thing I do is look at my phone. Oh, you look at the phone first. <laughs> yes. Okay. That's interesting. Yes. Yeah. I do that too. I, I look at Facebook. Right. Uh, to, see, to see what's going on in, in the world. Right, um, right. And I, and I check. Uh, my messages, I look at Messenger and WhatsApp. Once he's gotten his morning updates, it's time to work out. Zuckerberg typically exercises about three times a week. Sometimes he brings his dog Beast along. The tech CEO says running with his pet has the added bonus of being hilarious because it's basically like seeing a mop run. Beast is a Hungarian sheepdog with quite an impressive coat. Once he's gotten his exercise in, Zuckerberg is not too picky about what he eats for breakfast. He usually just digs into whatever he feels like having that day. He doesn't like to waste time on small decisions. That's also why he wears the same thing almost every day. Take any of the world's leading entrepreneurs, movers, or shakers, and they probably have a few things in common. They get up early, they stay focused, and, well, they wear the same damn thing every day. Zuckerberg's work uniform consists of jeans, sneakers, and a gray t-shirt. When asked about his wardrobe in 2014, he told the audience, I really want to clear my life to make it so that I have to make as few decisions as possible about anything except how to best serve this community. I really want to clear my life to make it so that I have to make as few decisions as possible about anything except how to best serve this community. When you consider how many times you've stood in front of your closet scratching your head and unable to make a decision, the thought of a go-to outfit might sound more appealing and make space for more achievements in your life, or even less of a mess in your bedroom. His Palo Alto home is tricked out with a custom-made artificially intelligent assistant. Zuckerberg puts in 50 to 60 hours a week at Facebook, but he thinks about the social media platform constantly. I spend most of my time thinking about how to connect the world and serve our community better, but a lot of time isn't spent in our office or meeting with people or doing what you'd call real work, he told CNN. In 2017, The Verge reported that Zuckerberg has some help managing his own social media channels. A squad of 12 employees helps him eliminate inappropriate comments and post updates on his Facebook page. When he's not working, Zuckerberg spends most of his time expanding his mind. He's learning Mandarin Chinese. He also tries to tackle as many books as he can. In 2015, he challenged himself to read a new book every two weeks. Zuckerberg's daily schedule tends to vary more on his frequent travels. He's met all sorts of big names, including world leaders like Pope Francis, former U.S. President Barack Obama, and celebrities like his personal friend Vin Diesel. In 2017, Zuckerberg embarked on several trips around the U.S., prompting some to speculate that he's interested in a future career in politics. Whether he's traveling or working, Zuckerberg also spends time with his wife, Dr. Priscilla Chan, and his daughters, Max and August. He took a two-month parental leave from Facebook after Max was born in December 2015. In March 2017, the couple announced they were expecting another daughter, August, who is now three years old. Every night before going to bed, the Facebook CEO tucks Max in with a traditional Jewish prayer, the Mai Shibiarach. Now, as the parents of two daughters, Maxima and August, with his wife, Priscilla Chan, Zuckerberg has swapped out late-night hacking binges for sleep routines with his children. During a commencement speech at Harvard University, Zuckerberg talked about a bedtime ritual he had with his daughter Max. I am reminded of a prayer, my Shibarach, that I say whenever I face a big challenge that I sing to my daughter thinking of the future when I tuck her in at night, he said. And it goes, may the source of strength who has blessed the ones before us help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing. During a 2015 Quora Q&A with Facebook Chief Operating Officer Sheryl Sandberg, she recounted a story about Zuckerberg's disbelief that she would be asleep by 9 30 p.m. When I joined Facebook, there were only 550 employees, and late-night meetings and all-night hackathons were a core part of the culture. I realized even before I started that I wasn't going to totally fit in. One night, as Mark and I were considering working together, I called Mark at 9 p.m.
p.m. He said he was at dinner and asked if I could call later, so I told him I'd be up for another 30 minutes. The next morning, he reached out asking if I was feeling okay. He assumed that I'd been sick since I went to bed at 9.30 p.m. I explained that with two children, 9.30 p.m. was often my normal bedtime. I love that Mark is now experiencing parenthood firsthand. I don't think he yet has a 9.30 bedtime, and maybe one day he will. According to Mark, enough rest is very essential, but he is not much of an early sleeper. Very few individuals can say that they made an astronomical impact on the world of social media. Even fewer of these individuals can say that they did so from within the walls of their dorm room. Mark Zuckerberg isn't most individuals, though. Zuckerberg and four of his classmates launched Facebook on February 4, 2004 from their dorm room at Harvard University. Here, we are over 15 years later and Facebook is now a multi-billion dollar company. Despite there being many fallouts, setbacks, and scandals, Zuckerberg has remained as the CEO of Facebook, which also has made him one of the wealthiest individuals on the planet and he is now worth more than $100 billion. Not bad for a kid from White Plains, New York. What I really like is the fact that despite being the CEO of one of the largest companies in the world, Zuckerberg is still very much a family man. From somebody who believes that family is everything, this is a habit of his that we very much admire. It's also important to start your day off doing what's important to you. While Zuckerberg does check Facebook, he also makes sure to incorporate some exercise and family time into his daily life. No matter how successful you are in life, it's always a good idea to start your day off with what's most important to you. And that's something that Zuckerberg does very well. 